Hello and welcome back to Hyperplay RPG. I had an excellent delivery today. Um, we like to import games from around the world and our current favourite importer, we think, is going to be VGP in Canada Video Games Plus. So, let's see what we ordered and crack it open. Now, we're in the UK and looking at this, if you know, you know. Just going to say that you pay your taxes up front and this arrived without any issues whatsoever and quickly too so you can order from VGP Video Game Plus in Canada without any worries about any extras if you know what I mean so let's crack it open and see what's inside I mean, judging that we called Hyperplay RPG you may guess what these games are going to be genre wise and also, they are, oh, there we go, nice thank you, pixelated. Also, they are on our favourite modern console, which is of course the Nintendo Switch. So what have we got? I'm trying to remember what we ordered. Death End Request, uh, that's a turn-based RPG, a bit of a hidden gem. So they say, people like Eric Landon on his RPG channel talk about Death and Request, so it's a good one. Uh, it became very expensive, it went out of print. But the great thing about Video Games Plus is you can often find reprints of out of print games, particularly Switch games. So fantastic to have this. And that was about £30, incredibly enough. And that includes all the taxes. Shadows Over Loathing, the follow up to uh, the hit. Uh, <laughs> comedy RPG West of Loathing, which is one of our favourite games and will soon be featuring in our top 10 RPGs ever, in fact. Um, so very excited to play the sequel, Shadows Over Loathing. And this is quite hard to get hold of, done by Serenity Forge. And VGP is brilliant for getting hold of these hard-to-find games because they also do a limited run, or they also offer limited run games on their website. So, yeah, very excited to get hold of Shadows Over Loathing, that's a, even though it doesn't say it, it's something of a special edition, there's extras in there, uh, cards and a map and so on, other bits and pieces, so very exciting. And then last but not least, certainly, is the much anticipated physical release of Sea of Stars, the JRPG indie smash hit from well, earlier in the year, uh, or late last year let's say. So, there we are, fantastic to have all these. £111 delivered. That is all. So, what are we saying there? You know, just over £30 a game, all the way from Canada. Some of these very hard to get hold of. Highly recommended using Video Games Plus. Also, a little tip for you if you go onto Twitter or X as we have to call it these days and send Video Games Plus a uh, a message, an X post, whatever, a tweet, let's say, um, and say, you know, looking at buying some games for the first time, please would you send us a DM? We saw someone else do this. Um, they asked for a little bit of help with buying some games, let's say, and they were told to uh, to check their DM. So go, go on to Twitter or X, find Video Game Plus uh, in Canada, and just message them and say, um, buying some games from you for the first time, I um, wonder if you could DM us, please. And when they DM you, something might come which will help you, help make that purchase even easier. That's all we're going to say, um, because, you know, that's not an official thing, but that's something we found and learned, and we want to help our lovely subscribers and viewers. Um, to which end, please do subscribe. Like I say, we've got the uh, 10 top RPGs of all time coming. There's a few twists and tails in there for sure. And also, if you have any interest in emulation, uh, then we have loads and loads of videos on brilliant emulation consoles from China, like the RG35XXH or the R36S. If that means anything to you, please subscribe. If you liked this video and it could be useful for you importing to the UK or elsewhere, please subscribe. And do stay tuned for that top 10 RPG list. Thanks for your time. Take care. Bye-bye.